Winston Edmonton here with Studio B, here at IBM Edge 2013. I've got Stan Wysocki with Mark III Systems. Stan, I understand that uh, you were recognized by IBM today. Yeah, absolutely. We got a choice reward for uh, the work that we've been doing in the uh, pure space, and um, it's uh, really nice to be recognized in front of all of your peers. You know? That is impressive. That really is. Now, I was just down where they have the pure... Uh, set up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. A lot of customers over there. Oh, absolutely. So tell me a little bit about what you do. So, um, you know, we're, we're a regional business partner. We're based in Houston, Texas. And, um, you know, we service Houston, Austin, San Antonio. We, we've been in, uh, pretty much an IBM only partner for 18 years. So wow. we have a very large customer base. And with Pure, I think, um, you know, there's a lot of partners here that deserve this award. There's a lot of people doing great things in Pure. Um, I think one thing that separates us, a couple things that separate us is um, we've had some early success. So we, we closed quite a few large deals last year, which is nice, and um, we've also closed several competitive deals, competing against UCS, HP takeouts, and and so forth. And, um, yeah, and we we focused mainly more on the um, Blade Center 2.0 kind of message, right? Which is uh, follow on to the Blade Center and 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 selling the value of a of a product at the beginning of the life cycle, the massive I/O capabilities to handle different changes in, in IT paradigms. And uh, the message that we're, that we're delivering to our customers and our prospects is working. So one of the other things that we've been doing is um, uh, we've been freely sharing how we're selling it to the rest of the, uh, the Pure team. And you know, I mean, from, from my perspective, if IBM increases their market share in Pure, it's going to help me sell sure. in my territory. Well, tell me about that, because you've got a lot of organizations that understand they need to make some changes, but they drag their feet. You know, they, they, they try to hold off as, as long as they can, sometimes longer than they really right, should. Right. What, what is the message that you're giving that, that uh, is helping them understand the value of you know, jumping in and, and, and getting this done now? Well, I mean, it, it, I think you said the exact thing. So people like to hold on to their technology, right? But if you hold on to a, a server, right, or even a blade for five, six years, at the end of that life cycle, it's not doing nearly what you need, right? It's, it's, it's slow. Your, your workloads have changed from when you bought it, um, and that is the exact value that we're selling with Pure, that you can buy it today and have the same infrastructure 10 years down the road, and who knows what you're gonna be doing 10 years from now, and it has enough horsepower and flexibility to handle whatever you're doing wow. for 10 years. So I, I, that, that's, a, that's, a, that's a really strong message that I think was missing from IBM's initial message that they were sending out. It's uh, it's it's investing in their. It's not investing in their now. It's investing in their future. Absolutely. Interesting. Absolutely. Now, uh, you've been a partner for 18 years. Yes. Very impressive. Yes. What excites you as far as IBM, uh, the future and the trends that you, that you see? What what are you excited about? You know what? Um, it, it, seems like for the last 10 years or so, every year I say, you know, it's uh, never been better to be an IBM business partner. And, and, and I can absolutely say that today. You know, we have a, um, being IBM only, you know, we have fewer tools in our toolkit to go to our customers, right? So what we do is we, we take the best that IBM has to offer at any given point in time. And um, we bundle those into good solutions so that we can sell value to our customers. Right now, um, we can sell XIV, we can sell real-time compression, we can sell pure systems. Uh, there, there's uh, sand volume controller for storage virtualization. There's so many great products that the competition can't touch. And um, so, so we, we keep ourselves busy with just what we have you know, on the plate right now. And, um, and it's working. Give me some case studies. You know, we've got folks that watch, and sometimes for some reason they just don't think that what we're talking about applies to them. Sure. Uh, give me some case studies, and I think sometimes when people hear that, they realize, you know what, that I fit that mold. I, that, yeah. I could, I could, I could take advantage of that. Yeah, absolutely. So, so uh, yesterday up on stage, I had a customer with me from the Rowan companies. They're uh, they're based in Houston. They they have uh, thirty some odd oil rigs throughout the world, right? Um, they're an HP shop with Cisco for their core network. And Cisco was pushing UCS very hard. And they needed to refresh their data center, but they hadn't yet invested in Nexus, right? So, so the solution for UCS involved a, a massive upgrade to their core infrastructure, and they were hesitant to do that. Additionally, it would require um, EMC storage. They already had some, but they would have had to um, upgrade it, and that was a, another major uh, change for them, right? So we came in with a, with a, a, a pure solution in XIV, and um, 
the, the XIV sold itself, right? It's, <laughs> it's the easiest product to manage. I mean, he even says, you know, it feels like we have a full-time equivalent employee yeah. living inside of it that just takes care of it for them, you know? Um, but, but we were able to come in with a, a much simpler solution that, that does everything that they need. They didn't need to upgrade their core. And then we also bundled System X servers and some DS3500 storage for their oil rigs. So uh, the other thing that he said was very important to them was a single vendor solution, right? Who do I go to for support? Yeah. Well, uh, UCS couldn't do that, right? They're, they're, a, uh, they're a Cisco EMC solution. And then you know, on their oil rigs where they just needed a server or two, what option do they have? Another UCS out there that was overkill times 34 sure. oil rigs. So we had a, a, an outstanding solution. And I think if people uh, uh, take a step back, look at their environment, um, and look at the actual value that you get out of Flex Systems versus the, the, the marketing glitz that IBM kind of tends, <laughs> tends to push, um, uh, they'll, they'll see that it's a good fit. Now, I'm still blown away by the 18-year relationship you have with mm -hmm. IBM. But tell me about uh, 2013, IBM Edge. How, how, do you, how do you compare this event with last year's event? Oh, wow. Um, it's, uh, it's, it's doubled in size, right? So last year was, was storage only, right? I think it's very natural for them to inc include the pure in, in the cloud um, in the overall message because it goes hand in hand. Um, I like the fact that not all of the speakers are IBMers that they're bringing under industry analysts. I enjoy the I enjoy when they bring customers up on stage to to talk about um, the value that they get because, like I said, the value that a customer get doesn't necessarily match the message that IBM is selling. Right. So, um, and and we have a bunch of our customers here as well. So, um, that already have a bunch of these IBM products, right? But you know, they see how other customers are using triggers their uh, imagination. So that, and, and you know, and we're already having conversations about. <laughs> what we're going to sell them next. <laughs> That's great. So the folks that are listening, and now they understand that, yeah, this is applicable. How can they get in touch with you? What's the best way to, to, to learn more about what you do? Oh, thank you. Uh, thank you for that. Uh, yeah, um, get us on the web, uh, markiiisys.com. Um, our website, we're kind of kind of going through a, a, a major redo. So what you see tomorrow may not be what you <laughs> what you see uh, uh, today, but it's, uh, it's, it's got our contact information. Um, we also have a toll-free number, 888-M-A-R-K-I-I-I. It's not 111, because that gets you a, a bad, a bad uh, uh, company. But um, Mark I-I-I, 888-M-A-R-K-I-I-I. Perfect. Very good. Appreciate you coming out. Winston, thank you very much. Winston Edmondson, Studio B, signing out.